Welcome back students. This is Mrs. Craig from the Counseling Department. A few updates. Grades will be final at the end of the day, Wednesday, January 4th. Schedules will continue to be updated through this week and possibly next week for seniors in need of courses to graduate or other students with possible failures. There were also several changes to the math schedule, so those sections are still being adjusted through this week. Advisory January 3rd through Monday, January 9th. What is career and academic planning? So career and academic planning is the process of looking at your courses you've taken, the courses that you want to take, and your individual plan to graduation. This plan will include academic goals, personal goals, and an exploration of college and career opportunities. So who will help you with these tasks? Your counselor, advisor, teachers, and parents and guardians. So this is the timeline of tasks that we you will complete this week and then through Monday. And I just noticed that it is January 9th, next Monday, so I will update that date. So today you are watching this introductory slideshow. Next, you will watch the course catalog video that Dr. Miller has provided. And then you will watch the course videos with the remainder of the class time. And then you need to um, take your time throughout the next week in the coming weeks before you meet with your counselor to look at the other courses that you might be interested in. On Wednesday, you will work on your Naviance course planner, updating the courses that you've completed through the fall of this year. We are not going to worry about grades at this time because final grades are not complete and you will not be able to see your transcripts yet. We're just focusing on the courses and there will be an instruction video along with that. On Thursday, a credit check. So you will continue the credit check you either started last year. You should have saved that in a Google Drive that we asked you to, to create um, called um, your current academic planning folder. If not, you will have a link to a new transcript, um, sorry, credit check that you can complete at this time. Your advisors will be given your individual transcript worksheets so you'll be able to work from those. On Friday, you'll be introduced to the registration form. There will be also a detailed infographic with all of the links you will need for registration process for the next school year. This is a very important form. You will need to bring this with you when you meet with your counselor. English teachers will let you know when your meeting date is scheduled for. We will be meeting with all students, grades 9th through 11th, throughout the month of January in your English classes. So that form is very important to have with you. On Monday, January 8th, we will wrap up all the tasks that we started from Tuesday through Friday for students maybe that were absent or that you did not have time to complete. And before students meet with their counselor, it is important that you have all of these tasks completed or we will need to reschedule your individual time. So if you have any questions, be sure to reach out to your advisor and any specific questions, you can email your teacher. So over, I'm sorry, email your counselor. Remember that over the course of January, we will be in the English hall for much of the time. So if you need us, you can email us or stop by the counseling office and let Mrs. Kretzer know that you need to talk to us and she will be sure to get a message to us. Next steps. So watch the course catalog video together as a class. Dr. Miller will give you all of the highlights. You will have access to this soon and you will be able to look through it at your own, at, on your own time. Look through the course videos on your own time to see which courses that you might be interested in. And then look in your Google Classroom for your individual timeline tasks. Have a great rest of your day.